Okay. Ah! Talking over... Taking over someone's house as easy as giving them a little bite. Uh, okay. All right, let's go hunting. Oh, I have to use the... Uh, hold on. Let me switch. I have to use my up-down arrows. Okay. I have to use my up-down arrows. Which I tried earlier, but it, it doesn't do. A beanie? So I have to infect these people? What? What is this? Yeah, it was frozen. Kebab! Oh my god, it's so loud. Hi, how are you? Well, yeah. I'm oh, fine, just as an old lady can be, dear. How about yourself? Are you lost or just trying to find an old lady to bother? I was just wondering if you could uh, read me a bedtime story. Have you had a gun? Watch your sweet little thing with a taste for stories. I'll tell you a tale, but you have to promise not to fall asleep or you might wake up in a not so pleasant dream. Oh, ma'am, you are so nice. I would love a bedtime story. Please read me one. <laughs> Alright, I'll indulge you with a story. Once upon a time in a quaint little town, there lived a mischievous little soul who could charm who could charm anyone they encountered, but little did you know the sweet facade hit a dark secret. Oh no! What was the secret? <laughs> That secret is quite dark for you, but I'll give you a hint. It involves stolen diamonds, secret hideouts, and a case of mistaken identity. Now should I invite you in some fresh cookies or you should be on your way? Oh, yes, ma'am. I would love some cookies. I would love to eat your delicious baked goods. <laughs> oh, you're such a sweetheart. How can I resist? Come on in, dear. Have a delightful time enjoying us. Some warm, freshly baked cookies together. I'm gonna eat you. Hey, I'm sure I'm back. No, I'm back. I'm just a grandma. Okay, one out of thirty-one. Oh, the cops. Hello, hello. Hello, Mr. Police. The dog will find us with that. Hi, little swipe. It is I, Granny Maud. I brought you some fresh cookies. Would you let me come inside and feed them in your mouth? <laughs> yeah, I appreciate the cookies, but I can't have no one feed me like that. Respect the boundaries. Stay outside, no hard feelings. What? That didn't go well. Hello! Oh my god! Just an innocent grandma with the sniffle. <laughs> Oh my god, Jay, thank you so much for the 4567. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Oh! There's a popo. Ah! 
Why is he coming closer? Where do I go? Oh my god. Is she alright? Oh wait, we forgot to put on our... We forgot to put on our costume! Okay. I brought business in. Yes, I'm lost. Can you help me find my dad? Have you ever gone? I lost him when I was trying to find him at the People's Choice Awards. I won the People's Choice Award. I was a recipient. I'm cool. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh. You won an award? Sorry, bud, but something quite doesn't... Okay. Sorry, I'm a little embarrassed. See, I'm shy and I can't find my clothes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bless your heart. No more I've been in a few sticky situations. Why don't you come in? I'll lend you a hand finding some clothes. No need to be shy, eh? Oh, thank you so much. You're so kind. I wish more people were like you. <laughs> Good old Canadian lumberjack. Come on in. It's it's Spexy's family member. <laughs> Welcome to the great outdoors. Okay. I got you. I got you. I declare the hospitality. I know. I win. I won, guys. All right, how do we get in this house? This house is fancy. Exactly. Uh, what brings you knocking on this ungodly hour? I was just chopping some wood and now I can't find my dog. Have you seen a dog come by? Twitch Pop Rock, baby. thanks for the nine months. Oh, I'm a fun one. Maybe he ran off in the woods? Oh, man. I can't believe that I can't find my dog. We should call the dog hospital and see if any hospital dogs are him. <laughs> 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 Okay. Oh my god, thank you so much! Ah, I can't stop crying, you're so nice! <laughs> Whoa! Don't mention it, just doing my part to help fun for Lumber, Jack, and me. No need for them tears. Let's see if we can find your pup. Thank you so much. I don't know where I'd be without you. <laughs> Uh -huh. You're too kind, friend. You know what? Why don't you come in? We'll make some tea while we figure out how to find your dog together. Stranger danger. I'm the stranger. <laughs> J-Bo, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh my God. Can we lick the gifter? Lick the gifter. Oh, I have a ponytail. Oh, I'll wear this instead. No, I'll wear the beanie. I need to let go of this axe. Why do I have an axe? Okay, that's good. A golden kappa? What? No way. What the heck? Also, high ray. Oh, the po the popo. 
Golden Kappa Pasties Licky. Oh my god. Taco Cat, thank you for 100 bits. Guys, we have a Golden Kappa. I heard they got nerfed. I heard they got nerfed this past uh, week. Oh my god. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks for the hype train. I'm going to try to go back to that original house. Thank you very much. Yeah, we had a sub purge and everything, so I appreciate you. Where ID card on Lanyard? Oh my god, Dollar Burr! Thank you so much for the gift sub! Thank you! Thank you kindly. Oh my god, we have to think of a lie. Oh my god! I'm lost and I just got dumped. It's Valentine's Day. I can't believe she left me on Valentine's Day. What the heck? <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, sweetheart, I'm so sorry to hear that. You must be feeling really down. Come on in. Let's talk about it. Work up team. I'm going to help you feel better. She's going to riz me up. I was I like love. 10 years old. Oh, we were watching TV, TV and they had on male strippers. And they started dancing around and I got really excited and I said, Mom, are they about to take off their pants? And they looked a little concerned. And then the next morning I recounted the entire thing in great detail to my grandma. And she said, well, I don't like that sort of thing. And I said, I do. I love it, Grandma. I hit the wrong button. Thank you so much, Flip, for the 800 bits. Thank you. Pushing us up to a level three golden cap. I get your golden cappers if you want. Hi, Speedy's pussy pussy. Ew, what the heck? Majestically through the sky, but I can walk. They can walk. Other Pokemon can dig. That's real deep and big, but I can walk. They can walk. Thank you so much, Taco Cat, for the 777. Thank you very much. I can't stop coughing. Ever since I've heard that grandma sneeze, it's been a cough city over here. All right. Um. Oh my gosh, a warm cup of tea to take off the frozen part of my body. <laughs> Allie, thank you so much for the 369. Thank you. That's the spirit, honey. Nothing like a warm cup of tea to soothe the soul. Come on in. I'll get the kettle bowling. It's going to be fun. Just you see. Flip, thank you so much. <laughs> I don't want to say it. Flip, thank you so much for getting to the sound KYR Speedy's musty bussy. Bussy. Ugh. Thank you so much for inviting me to your home. I'm sure your home is going to be just as warm Past as your cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Cree, thanks for the bits. Vodka, thank you so much for the 500 bits. <clears throat> You're so sweet to say that, honey. I'm delighted to have you in my cozy little home. Let's make Valentine's Day a little oh, brighter yes, together. Oh my god. From head to toe. Toe to head. Toe to head. Head to, head to toe. To toe. <laughs> oh my god, we're gonna kill her. Wait, I'm not tapped in. Oh, wait, 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 Thank you so much, Taco Cat, for the 666. Y'all are unhinged today. I love it. Thank you so much. Okay. What did the horse say after it tripped? Help. I've fallen and can't get up. Okay, thank you so much for the 20 months. Better giddy up on here. Giddy up. We're killing it. I'm just a bad and my life is a nightmare. He ain't gonna get me, right? Sunday, thank you so much for the 10 months. Thank you. I'm not a rat. I'm not a rat. rat. Ah! I have bug spray. What was that? Oh. <laughs> Gatorade. Taco Cat, thank you so much for the 363. Thank you so much. Trevor, thank you so much for gifting us up to Tomcat Bandit. Thank you very much. How am I going to get out of this pickle? 
Okay, we're gonna go over here. This is a fun game. <gasps> I just threw my clothes off. Actually, I, as soon as I knocked on your door, my pants fell inside your home. You must have a really strong HVAC system. Oh my God. <laughs> what a load of hogwash! I don't need an explanation for why you ain't wearing Just take your business elsewhere. Hog. Oh my god, Slade! Hi, what's up, homie? Thanks for the 14 months! Hog. A lot of hog wash. Is the cops gone? Yeah, they're gone. Okay, I found the cops. Look, he's in there! Look at him! Oh! <gasps> What's gonna happen? Oh my god. Guys, thanks for the level 5 Kappa height train. I appreciate it. Oh, he's gone. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, yes, we had reports of a naked man coming into people's homes, knocking on their doors, and saying that he lost his pants. Are you okay, sir? <laughs> oh my god, free whole egg, Joe! Thank you so much for the 10 gifted! Thank you! Oh my god, he slammed the door in the security guard's face! Oh my god. Oh, we're fucked. Oh, we're fucked. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Thank you for all that. Lick the gifters! Lick the gifter! Oh my god. Oh my god, guys, thanks for that hype train. Thank you so much. You guys are getting scammed real hard right now. Uh, I heard you like stripper grams. And lady, you're gonna be under arrest. <laughs> Excuse me, who do you think you are? Get off my property right now. I don't have time for this nonsense. <sighs> Shit. That didn't go so good. Okay, we're fine. This is the neighborhood. This is the neighborhood watch. Oh, that's the neighborhood watch. Oh, okay. A beer helmet. Let's go. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, 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 well, 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 what do we have here? Another super curious about my ground break experiments. Hi, I'm from the Institute and I came to give you your uh, research. Uh, I'm your partner, uh, newly assigned. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Huh? Well, it don't sure waste any time sending newbies to me. What's your name? Guys, give me a name. I'm gonna say Frijole Joe. Frijole Joe just gifted. Yes, my name is Frijole Joe. Uh, I am from the island of Twitch. <laughs> Change back into the grandma outfit. Give her a mm. super gran. Okay. I'll do a stripper gram. Free hole. She said free hole. Free. No! It's supposed to be for hole and not free hole. Oh my god. Is that a new drag name? Free hole Joe, hey? Well, Twitch Island, huh? Sounds like an interesting place. You must have. Hold on. Let me move the chat off of this. I'm so sorry. I didn't even realize chat was on it. This is a disaster. <laughs> this is a disaster, guys.
What has happened? Identity theft is not a joke, Pasta. Oh my god! Here, let me go this. You dumb whore. Wait, this is, I'm not free all I'm free old Joe. Uh, let's step into my lab and have a chat, partner. I have cancer. <laughs> I'm so yeah, sorry. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. No! Institute. <laughs> the Institute. I'm sorry. I can say that, okay? I can say that. Now, where's Grandma's clothing? <laughs> I didn't know what else to say. It's the first thing that came to my head. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, God. I, I need. Where's Grandma's clothes? <laughs> free holy joes oh yeah it's free i was free whole joe okay um we're gonna pretend we're a bike or a bike rider and we broke down oh god i forgot we were free holy well, that was just a turn of, a, a, of events. <laughs> so, sorry, Friola. Okay, we're fine. I need clothes. Where's Grandma's outfit? Wait, what is this? Ooh! Guys, thank you so much for the level seven hype train, you guys. That is too much. Thank you so much. I don't know where to go. Let's go on this side. Where is grandma's pants? I thought it was on this side. <sighs> Wait, here's some clothes. Golf. Oh, this is a beer helmet. I thought that was golf clubs. What was that? A rifle? <coughs> a stethoscope? Okay. Ah, whoa. Paint the town red. Hi, I'm here for our date. It's so finally nice to meet you. I definitely swiped left on Tinder or right or whatever. I don't know. I've never used Tinder. <laughs> I don't want them. I'm just a busy doctor. Not exactly. Sorry, you should. Oh, fuck, fuck. Doctors go on dates. Damn it! <laughs> Is the neighborhood watch suddenly police in my doorstep with their fancy beer helmets? What brings you here tonight? Uh, yes, it is me, Pasta of the Neighborhood Watch. I just want to make sure you're doing okay. And also, I was wondering if you have any experiments you'd like to try out. <laughs> As for experiments, I'm always up to something experimental, but it depends. Are you open-minded and ready for a little risk? Use my body for your personal gain, doctor. <laughs> oh god misunderstanding i'm a doctor not a mad scientist my experiments are strictly 
but I thank you for offering, I suppose. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, any experiments you need to get done, uh, I would love to assist you. I'm all for the benefit of humanity. <laughs> oh, well, well, well. Aren't you the type... Oh, quite the eager volunteer. I appreciate your enthusiasm, but let's not get ahead of self. First, I need to know more about your qualifications and background. What makes you believe you're fit for these experiments? Oh my god. I watch a lot of anime, and I work out a ton. Uh, I have a body built by Doritos and Mountain Dew, so I'm an anomaly. Uh -huh. Oh, anime and Doritos are uh -huh. in combination, but I must say being an anime aficionado and having a taste for junk food doesn't qualify as an ideal candidate for my expert. I appreciate your interest, though. Really, though, I'm extremely healthy. I work out five times a week. I have a great fiber intake, and I drink a lot of water. Oh, yeah. oh you certainly do seem to have a healthy work <laughs> Regular workouts and good hydration are key. I'm starting to consider the possibilities. I see one final test to see if you're truly ready. Are you prepared to face the dreaded to tofu challenge? I have never been more ready than this moment. Right here, right now, doctor. Jay, thanks for the water. Oh, yeah. Your enthusiasm and willingness to take on the tofu challenge has won me over. Come in my eager volunteer. Let's see what experiments we can cook up together. Just be prepared for the unexpected. <laughs> Should have stayed in vet school. How do I take off? Hold on. Oh my god! Oh! Get away. Teeny bit slight, I want to demand why you're disturbing with your fancy thermometer in hand. Through your windows, you, you dumb, dumb whore. whore. Uh, <clears throat> yes, I was hired from the neighborhood watch to check everyone's temperature. There is a outbreak of the flu, and I need to check it right now. Oh, yeah. Outbreak of the flu? Well, if there's an outbreak, I certainly don't want you bringing it into my house. Goodbye now. I'm a doctor! Oh. <sighs> I just got Donald Wald. Oh my god, we just walked past him. Okay. Oh, hello. What kind of buzzkill has interrupted my internal sadness this late at Dr. or Mr. Scientist? I'm actually a doctor, and uh, I was sent here to tell you about your exam results, your lab results. Holly, you can't do that, buddy. No. <laughs> Just when I thought my life couldn't get worse, a doctor's here to deliver bad news. Just get it over with. I'm already dead inside. Well, the results are is that you are a perfect human being, uh, and you've won a million dollars. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait, what? Are you serious? A perfect human being and a million dollars? This must be some sick joke. No one's perfect, especially not me. But hey, if it's true, maybe there's a glimmer of hope in this dull world after all. Yeah, I can't. Uh, it was one of those things where it was a competition of who was the best human being. And guess what? You won. You have perfect lab results and the best genes. Are you serious? I won? I can't believe it. Maybe there's a shred of greatness in this dark and soul of mine. Come on and let's celebrate this unexpected victory. Oh my God, we won. <laughs> Finally get to meet my dark lord. This is 
great. Uh oh. Oh, I don't know. Isn't it Fallout Roy living by him in a hot topic clearance rack? What brings you to my door? Did you run an eyeliner again? Oh my god, what do we say? I just found out that I won a million dollars and I have the perfect body. Like jeans, everything. I am an anomaly. <laughs> the word of the day. Oh, yeah. Well, well, look could just say a crawl out of the goth cave enjoying the land of the winners. Congrats on the million dollars, but I gotta say, you being the perfect body is a bigger fantasy than your favorite vampire romantic novels. It's okay. Um, I don't know what to do with all this money. What should I do with this million dollars that I just won? Would you like some money? <laughs> Whoa! Invest in some class? What? Lord knows you need it more than I need your spare change. What a bitch. Well, not only did I win a million dollars, but I won an invitation to the royal wedding. It's tomorrow and I can bring a guest. Would you like to come? <laughs> Wow, I want to have food. Hold your fishnet stockings because this is a shocker. The royal wedding? Me? Well, I guess even the queen needs a good laugh every once in a while. Sure, I'll be your plus one, but I can't promise I won't steal the spotlight with my killer dance moves. Dance moves. Great, I'm so glad you're coming with me to the royal wedding. Uh, could I borrow an outfit and could you help maybe give me a makeover so I don't embarrass myself? <laughs> oh honey, consider the charity event of the century. I'll hook you up with a makeover that'll make the royal family question their fashion choices. See you soon, my student to be stylish sidekick. Oh yeah. <laughs> We're winning. We are gonna win. What the fuck? Hi, my name is Tev. Why are you confused and unsure right now? Maybe I'm a moment, huh? I'm just a delicate soul, you know? Easily overwhelmed and uncertain about things. It's just who I am, I suppose. I like your fairy wings. <laughs> Come on! Oh, thank you! These wings are my pride and joy made myself. They're a symbol of my delicate and unique spirit. Oh my god! Hi, Rosebell! <laughs> Can you make me some fairy wings like yours? <laughs> ah, whoa. Oh, well, I'm flattered that you like my wings, but unfortunately, I can't. You see, I put so much delicate craftsmanship and love into making them, it would be impossible to replicate the same level of fragility and uniqueness. Well, if you can't make them like yours, can you show me how to make fairy wings? Maybe I can make them myself, and we can craft together. You can be my new best friend. <laughs> I was, huh? Oh wow, that sounds absolutely delightful! I'd be honored to be your new best friend and help you make your own fairy wings. <laughs> Please come inside, we can embark this whimsical adventure together. Okay, well, here we go. <laughs> Okay, this is good. <laughs> oh. Oh. Let's go back to... Ah! 
Okay, okay, here we go. No, the very wings, I know. I got for some free ketamine if you would like to have some drugs. <laughs> Hello, I'm Ah, <laughs> oh, I mean, I'm a law abiding citizen. I will not tolerate this nonsense. Get off my property immediately. Okay, it was worth a shot. I thought she might like some horse tranks. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's go around. Uh, let's go back into. This home. Oh. We're a fairy. <laughs> In the chaos, I think so. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, my God. A late night fairy knock on my dad and speak your manager, young lady. Hi, my name is Tinkerbell. I'm from Neverland. Uh, would you like some free tickets to a play tomorrow? <laughs> hello, hello. I have time for your fairy tales and freebies at the land. I hate her. Okay, all right, all right, we're gonna go back. <laughs> I'm a hammer. Late night fairy princess at my doorstep, Shenanigans. Hi, are you? Looking for the manager? Do you or do you not feel bonita? I feel bonita. I feel bonita. Uh -huh. Wonderful, uh -huh. because you look bonita. Where did you get your outfit? Oh my gosh. I have a million dollars and a free ticket to Italy. <laughs> I'm not good at this. Uh -huh. Oh! How can you notice my fabulous outlet? outfit? It's a limited edition designer piece. As for your generous offers, well, I do appreciate it, but I'm not easily swayed by things. That's okay. I just got back from a fashion trip from Milan and London Fashion Week. So, you know. <laughs> oh, I'm a fashion one. Milan and London Fashion Week? I did go on a shopping spree at the mall last weekend, so I know a thing too about fashion. Tell me, did you spot any famous, any famous designers while you were there? <sighs> uh, yes, Carl Lagerfeld was there, and uh, Nicole Richie was there. Ah, I buy you my hat. That's quite impressive, I must say. I mean, I met a few celebrities in my time, but rubbing shoulders with fashion icons is a whole different level. Let me tell you about the cupcakes in the house of Gucci. They are the best things I've ever put in my mouth. I put a lot of things in my mouth. <laughs> cupcakes in the house of Gucci? Well, you know, I have quite refined taste buds, young lady. But putting a lot of things in your mouth, that's not exactly the kind of conversation. Maybe we should move on to a more appropriate topic. Hey, Karen, you're the one that made it sexual. <clears throat> um, where did you get your sunglasses? <laughs> oh, my sunglasses from an exclusive boutique where they handpick the trendiest styles just for me. Takes a discerning eye to find the perfect pair, you know. But enough about me. Let's talk about the co your colorful ensemble. Where'd you get those? Uh, my butterfly wings? Uh, I can't believe you're early asking about these butterfly wings because uh, these are spring 2024 Versace. Uh, I feel like uh, you would know. Uh... I don't usually keep up with fashion trends that far in advance. But you say they're the latest thing, so I'm sure you're right. So do tell me. 
Do those wings have any special powers or is it just for show? The special power about these wings is that they are absolutely fabulous. <laughs> oh my god, so I just face for the tier bad. three. You certainly know how to make a statement, my dear. I may have not have wings, but I have impeccable sense of style. Maybe we could swap fashion tips sometime. Thank you so much, Slasher Space, for the tier three. Enjoy your uh fantastic emote. Your brand new and fantastic emote. Um Where'd you get your shoes? <laughs> oh, my shoes are hidden from a boutique in the heart of Paris. One of the most... What is she doing? What is she doing? I'm the most stylish and daring fashion needs to know about it. But I must say your enthusiasm for fashion is contagious. So tell me, what's the story behind those sparkly shoes of yours? First of all, sweet moves. Second of all, sick shoes. Third of all, I got these shoes from the store of Prada. Oh shit, it was too long. Uh, I, these are Prada 2024. <laughs> I'm impressed. Come on in my fashionable friend. Let's have a proper chat of all things. Stop glamour let's go let's go you're gonna die today karen you're karen my name is karen and i'm here to say i got a big booty Spooner Street. Let's go this way. Oh, good. This is a big place. He has a gun. What's all the rock about, Karen? Don't count. come around here causing trouble, capiche? Oh my god, sick gun. Where did you get that gun? I'm having a lot this little thing, I got it from a a friend. But let's not get into details. What brings you around here, doll face? <laughs> Honey, I'm scared and I need protection. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, sweetheart, this ain't exactly a safe neighborhood, but the kind of protection you're looking for ain't something I can just hand out like candy. You gotta earn it. What can you do for me? Baby, I can do anything for you. <laughs> Is that so, doll? Well, I gotta say, I admire your spirit. Stick with me and prove yourself, and maybe, just maybe, we can talk about earning a place in our crew. But you gotta be ready to get your hands dirty, understand? Oh, yeah, I'll get my hands real dirty. <laughs> That's the spirit, babe. You've earned yourself a spot. Welcome to the crew. Just remember, loyalty and respect are everything here. Follow me. I'll show you around and introduce you to the rest of the family. Let's go. <laughs> okay. That was easy. <laughs> Not easy. Hey, I'm I supposed to I make the hits. I'm a hero in love. <gasps> How do I get in this house? Oh my god. Here we go. It's 
Captain Jack Sparrow. How's it going? Welcome to Mr. East Channel. Thrilled to see you here, bringing my snacks and all. What's the story be behind that tasty box meal? Let's di dig in together and chat about the crazy adventures we can have on this channel. Oh my god, Mr. East, I'm a big fan. Kebab! That's amazing. I'm glad you're a fan. Come on, let's have a blast and make some awesome content together. Oh my god, that was easy! <laughs> this isn't very charitable. I'm a hero lap! Oh, sorry, Mr. East. Oh, hello. What? Miss Reese, what's up? Just sitting here after walling in my own misery after getting dumped harder than a sack of potatoes. But hey, I'm always up for some company in my pit of despair. Come on in, I guess. Thanks, man. Uh, I'm sorry you're not having a good day. We can cheer you up and I can give you a lot of money because my name is Mr. East. No. Nah. Thanks for the offer, Mr. East, but I don't think money can fill the void in my heart right now. If you want to win the year, listen. Oh, okay. Yeah, bro, I'd love to spend some time with you and get your mind off of things. Uh, you can vent to me. I care. A lot. <laughs> you actually care? Well, I guess I can use the company right now. Just warning, though. I might get a little emotional, so be prepared for sobbing and snot. But hey, thanks for being there. Homie, I'm already always oh 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 I oh <laughs> stutter. I <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh You're out of here, dude. You're too quick, but I appreciate you. Okay, let's get him. <laughs> <laughs> Should have swiped left on this. Nice. <gasps> why are you naked? Bro, why are you naked? I love going to go over there. Oh man, I'm all about that all natural living, you know? Clothes are like barriers for true selves, so I prefer to embrace the freedom of living, of being in my birthday suit. It's all about feeling the breeze. How did you get into this? How did you get into n being a nudist? This seems so cool. <laughs> Kebab! Well, brother, I'll start with a deep desire to connect with nature and be true to myself. I wanted to break free from so societal norms and embrace a more natural way of being. It took some time to get comfortable once I did, man. It was like a whole new world opened up. The freedom, the liberation, it's truly a groovy way to live, man. Can you teach me how to live like you? <laughs> I got a headache already from laughing. <laughs> Yeah, man, it's stoked to be guide you on your journey to nudist bliss. It's all about embracing your authentic self and connecting with nature. Start by spending time in nature, feeling the earth beneath your feet, and gradually shedding those clothes, man. Just remember to respect everyone's boundaries and enjoy the freedom, baby. Oh my god. Well, let me take this Excedrin. That sounds sick. Thank you so much for showing me the ropes of how to be a nudist. Wow, I wanna have food? No problemo, my friend. I'm always here to spread the nudist love and share the good vibes. If you're up to it, why don't you come on in? We can continue our naked journey together. Is he hitting on me? Just remember, expect and acceptance are the key. All right, let's do this. I love his hair. <laughs> I 
love his hair. We're doing great, guys. Regina P. Oh my god, who are you? Why are you here so late? Just spill the tea already. I just got dumped by my girlfriend and I need to tell somebody. <laughs> oh, I'm not your therapist. Keep your relationship drama to yourself and leave, loser. What the fuck? Okay. Get lost, loser! I don't have time for your pathetic pity party. Take your drama elsewhere. Okay, let's put something else on. Oh my god! 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 Ugh, what are you doing here? It's like late. Did you forget to like schedule an appointment or something? Did you just hear what happened to Kim Kardashian? What? Looks like our server is receiving too many requests. Office worker Barbie wannabe. Oh my god, did you hear what happened to Karen in finance? I really don't care about office gossip, so if that's what you're here to talk about, you can show yourself out. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! What's up, bad? Uh, well, Hallelujah, praise be. Welcome to Humber Abode, my blessed friend. How can you use this to the word of our Lord and Savior? Oh, this one's gonna be too easy. Oh, this is gonna be too easy. I've just sinned my last sin. I need to convert right now. Oh, my dear, repentance is a beautiful step towards salvation. Let me guide you to the way of our righteousness and help you find peace in our arms of our Lord. Would you like to hear more about our faith? Would I ever? I would love to hear about the church and all the things about the Lord. Oh, my blessed soul, you truly have touched by the divine inspiration. Our church is a beacon of light guided by the teachings of the scriptures. We gather in the prayer, study the word of God, support one another during our spiritual journey. The Lord's love is boundless, and through faith in him, we find eternal salvation. Can I come in and teach you the hymns that I have picked up in the last five minutes of talking to you? Oh, wonderful be to praise the Lord with your newfound hymns, although it must admit my voice isn't as glorious as some others. However, I love to be honored to listen from you. Let us lift our voices in worship and glorify his name together. Well, amen, brother! Amen indeed, my dear brother. You're enthusiasm and infectious and i'm filled with the joy of met you let's continue our conversation deepen our understands the lord's teaching may his blessings be upon us as we journey together in faith uh do you have an extra bible for me i seem to have lost mine <laughs> <laughs> of course, my dear brother, as a faithful servant of the Lord, it is my duty to ensure that his word reaches all who seek it. Allow me a moment, I shall fetch you a fresh copy of the Holy Scriptures. Wait here, I shall return shortly with a precious gift of God's word. Oh, don't leave me. I'm scared. I'm afraid I'm going to sin again. <laughs> Dear brother, fear not. The Lord is always with you, watching over you, guiding you in times of temptation. <laughs> Seek solace. <laughs> Seek solace in prayer and immerse yourself in His Word. Remember, we are all imperfect. <laughs> uh. 
Okay. Here we go. Oh, Praise me, seems that heaven has blessed me with a late night visitor. How may I assist you on? It is I, Angel Gabriel, and I have come to give you a vision. Oh, how splendid! I'm ready to, ready and willing to receive this divine vision. Please share it with me, Angel Gabriel. You shall open your arms to me and praise the Lord, for I, Angel Gabriel, will be giving you the word of the Lord. I can't fit it all. I'm happy. Dear friend, I appreciate you preaching, but I must clarify I'm a Father Price, a humble mission, not Angel Gabriel. Wait, oh, I think it's. But I am hearing the word, Lord, word of the Lord you bring. Please share with me. God will only allow those that believe to eat Taco Bell a current trap supreme. Oh, no. My friend, while I do believe in the power of faith, I must say Taco Bell is not a spiritual matter. I must bid. Fuck! Okay. God bless you on your journey. All right. Well, at least he was nice. Let's find a Satan outfit. Oh, a crown and angel wings? Okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm real blessed because I believe in Jesus. Addicted to bath salts, and then, and then one day I had a vision, and now I came to share that vision with you. <laughs> Plan your journey, but I humbly ask you to share your vision of the child. May God bless you on your path, but I cannot invite you. What? That's not even gonna work. Praise me, heaven, how delightful was I? Grace my humble doorstep. This. <laughs> how happy service you spreading the glorious world of the Almighty. Do you have time to hear about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? <laughs> Speak music in my ears. I can talk about the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for hours on end. Please do share the good news with me. What's your favorite book? My my favorite book is the book of Job. <laughs> Hi, Tom. Oh, the book of Job. True testament of faith and perseverance. My favorite book, without a doubt, is the Holy Bible itself. The words within its sacred pages guide us to the path of righteousness and bring us closer to our love and creator. Truly a treasure beyond compare. <laughs> okay, if you're such a good Christian, prove that you're a good Christian. What's your favorite store and... Why? I 
Is that what I have? Ah, uh, my dear friend, it warms my heart to see enthusiasm for my faith. However, I must apologize. I do not have a favorite store. As a missionary, my focus is spreading the teachings of Christ and non material buses. May ah! He fake Christians should have been Hobby Lobby! <laughs> <laughs> Pray tell what brings you a layer of madness on this gloomy evening. Uh, I seem to have forgotten my way. Uh, I want to be as mad as you are. <laughs> oh, lost soul seeking the madness of my realm. Fear not, for I have just the solution to awaken your inner madness. Allow me to fashion for you a custom made contraption that will surely distort your reality and plunge you into the depths of insanity. Thanks, I have spaghetti coming out my ass. <laughs> uh, oh. Um, that's quite <laughs> peculiar. Perhaps it's best if you continue on your way and seek my Say <laughs> so goodbye, my unique friend. <laughs> okay, alright. Oh! We'll find something else. No, no. Okay. Ah, whoa. I found a new invention, and I feel like you're the only one that's gonna be able to tell how cool it is. I don't even know how to talk anymore. Have you had a gun? An invention, you say? How intriguing. Describe this marvel of yours, dear artist, and allow me to assess its greatness. Guys, give me an invention. What are we gonna tell him? What kind of invention? A time machine? Okay. I, yes, I have discovered how to travel through space and time. I have invented a time machine. <clears throat> Excuse me. A time machine, you say? Oh, marvelous. Time travel is the key to unraveling the mysteries of the universe. Pry, enlighten me on the mechanics of your invention. Oh, fuck. I just dropped this thing. Hold on a second. Well, I took the flux capacitor in my DeLorean and then I made it into a washing machine, basically. So it works really good. <laughs> brilliant simply brilliant your ingenuity knows no bound down bounds dear artist please do come in and let's discuss her oh my god we're gonna conquer the world all right let's go <laughs> we did it all right i dropped my cap I have an idea. <laughs> well, 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 what do we have here? Oh my god, I didn't think I just broke a nail. A lowly scientist interrupting my fine state your business quickly. I don't have time for commoners and your and their silly gadgets. Would you like to travel back in time and rob a bank with me? <laughs> I have no interest in engaging in such lowly act. Good day to you, sir. What, what the fuck? Okay, there we go. My freaking Ray Moon, uh, whatever soda. Damn. Damn. Hmm. Mm. Oh, that's good. Where'd 
Where's my hair? <gasps> I could be somebody really posh. Oh, I could be the king. Do we have any other pants? We're sleeping. <laughs> uh, what is this? An AK 47? What the fuck? You don't recognize your own king? How dare you? He's kicking us out? You're going to jail. Beheading. You're beheaded. Oh, bunny ears. What is this? Do we have a different outfit to wear? This game is so crazy. I'm just a pretty girl. <laughs> Where'd you get your jacket from? <laughs> I know well, she's my challenging jacket herself, is from Gucci. Some of her brothers and sisters are probably like neurosurgeons, though. So. Came higher. <laughs> I can't even. Gucci is kind of basic. Sorry, bitch. You're right. I'm stuck on the light post. A gas mask? Hmm. Santa hat? We need different clothes. We can't be wearing the lab jacket the whole time. Wait, what is this? Oh, a pantsuit. Oh my god, what do you say to old people? Hi, Cloudsy! Guys, what do we say to him? Have you heard from your grandson? Hi, I have news about your grandson. <laughs> oh my god. I wish you huh? There's been an accident. <laughs> an accident is my grandson okay? Don't hold back on me now. <laughs> have you heard of the Apollo 13? Ah, he tried to recreate the Apollo 13. Oh, I will have a hover. Is he safe? Yes, he's safe. And he's proposed to me. And I am pregnant with his 
child. Come on. Well, B, my grandchild knows how to make an entrance. Does he bring yourself in and have a proper celebration for the new addition to the family? Let's go. That that is what we're talking about. <laughs> That was great, guys. We did so good. I'm going to still be fancy, I think. Bye, Grandpa. Wait, we haven't went in this home. <laughs> Philip Fancy Pants. Do you like coffee? The fact that it worked, right? Hey, mama. Meh, coffee's alright, I guess. Keeps me awake during those boring school mornings. Why do you act spy extraordinaire? Hmm. Hi, Ninja Turtle. I know you're really bored of school. What if you, what if you said, shit, hold on, let me just keep it going so I can. I know you're tired of boring school. What if I were to tell you that I had a job lined up for you, your dream job? Mm -hmm. Guys, what's a dream job? You're going to be a content creator and have millions of followers. <laughs> That's what kids like, right? Hey! Go pull your ambulance and raise your ass because I'm not Now get lost before I call the cops. I thought that's what kids liked. Every time I go, every time I go to the school and talk about it, all the kids are like, tell me how it really is to be a, co a content creator. And I'm like, ah, it's not that great. <laughs> she said school. Hey, what's up, fam? You look kind of hella fresh in the pantsuit shades. What's the word on the streets? We're on the streets just that you just won a million dollars. Say what now? Sorry, bro, but I don't have time for no scams. You better take that elsewhere. Peace. Okay, well, whatever. I gotta stop with the money. I thought the money would hook, line, sink, sinker people. Excuse me. We'll come back. I feel like I'm Welcome to the crypto den. What can I do for you tonight? Looking for a Bitcoin revolution? Hey, what's your opinion on Ethereum versus Bitcoin? I feel like I'm trying to scam a Twitter bots. Uh, uh, Ethereum versus Bitcoin, the ultimate showdown. Well, my friend, Bitcoin is the OG king of the... Oh my God, I don't care. Oh my God. Have you ever been on Twitter? <laughs> Come on. Oh, you bet, my friend. I'm all over Twitter spreading the gospel of Bitcoin to the masses. It's like our virtual clubhouse where we share memes, news, and celebrate the bull runs together. If you're not on crypto Twitter, then you're missing out on the adrenaline rush of fucking me. Oh my God. I knew it. I knew it. Bro, I got some sick NFTs. Dude, that's so awesome. NFTs are taking the art world by storm. It's like owning a piece of digital history. Now, here's what kind of NFTs do you have? Any rare collectibles or mind blowing artwork? Let's geek out on the uniqueness of the blockchain. I want to throw up. I want to throw Run, up. Bitch! Run! I know, right? I, Rose Bell, I'm literally dying. I'm literally dying. What's the one? What's the Bitcoin with the monkey face? What is the bit? No, uh, not Bitcoin, NFT. I can't even get the thing right. What is the NFT with the monkey 
face. Oh, NFT. Oh, bored ape. Bored ape. Dude, I have like six bored ape NFTs. Do you want to see them? Oh my god. Uh -huh. No way, bro. Board 8 Yacht Club oh, NFTs man. are the bomb. I'd love to see your collection, man. Swing by the crypto den. Let's have a closer look at these sick apes. We'll grab some virtual champagne and celebrate. Virtual champagne? He ain't gonna get you drunk. All right, we got this guy. He's easy. He was like a Twitter bot. <laughs> I want to die. Your your glasses were cooler. Oh no, my glasses were cooler. Look. Bye, bitch. Oh, no! <laughs> okay, it's getting harder now, guys. There's three of them. We'll go be grandpa. I'm just an old man. Oh my god. Wait, what is this? Uh, Ugh, what do you want? Make it quick. I got an essential dread to ponder an eyeliner to. <gasps> She's sad girl. Tell me about your hopes and dreams. Yeah, Hopes and dreams, seriously? Well, I guess my dream is to find a way to escape this mundane existence and discover something that actually makes me feel alive. But who am I kidding? It's just a stupid pipe dream anyway. I don't know how to combat this. <laughs> I don't know how to combat this! Have you ever watched a live stream before? Yeah, I watched a few live streams. I mean, what else am I supposed to do with my life? Oh, <laughs> shit! Guys, I knew this sounded familiar! <laughs> I knew her about talking about exis existential dread and being depressed and like being. It's chat! How do you feel about pasta? We'll see if it's specifically our chat. How do you feel Pasta, dude, pasta is life. It's like carbs and happiness all one on one. I could eat pasta every day and never get tired of it. It's one of the few things in this world that brings you joy. <laughs> Hi, chat. Hi, chat. You guys are great. <laughs> uh, how... Do you like video games? Have you been playing any new ones like Lethal Company? <laughs> video games? Now we're talk- Oh my god! It's you! It's you guys! They're like an escape from this crappy reality, you know? And yeah, I've been playing Lethal Company. It's pretty intense. I love the thrill of virtual battles and plump pummeling bad guys. Sorry, I've been drinking this like Ramune, whatever, and it makes me like bleh. One of the few things that gets my adrenaline pumping. They, she is literally us. How do you feel about uh, Genshin Impact or any kind of uh, gotcha games? Oh, yeah. Gotcha games like Genshin Impact? Yeah, I played that one too. It's not bad, I guess. It's kind of an addictive, you know, trying to get all those rare characters and all. But man, those microtransactions can really drain your wallet. It's a love-hate relationship for sure. Oh my god, so are you. I got a sick poll the other day on Genshin Impact, and I'm pretty excited about the new update. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Dude, that's awesome! Getting sick loot and getting excited for updates is what gaming's all about. I'm glad you're pumped for it. Maybe we can team up in Genshin Impact and rank some monsters together. That's way cooler than dealing with real-life problems, right? Oh my god, I'm so glad you feel the same way. I am also hopeless and have no hope in life except for pulling waifus and Genshin Impact. I'm glad we're on the same page. No way you get it! Finally, someone who understands. Screw real life. Let's dive in a virtual world and conquer it together. Come on in, we can geek out over Genshin Impact and forget all about the meaningless stuff for a while. Oh my god, it's you guys. <laughs> this is like so uncool. Uh, 
Um. Oops, 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 oops. What is this? Silence, VTuber. Silence, VTuber. No, it's you. <laughs> it is me. It is me. <laughs> this one. Hi, Empress. Oh, hello, hello. Hey, man, what's cracking? How can I help you this groovy night? What are your thoughts on weed? Oh, man, weed's like nature's gift, you know? I got so many medicinal properties, it can bring some serious relaxation vibes. But, you know, it ain't for everyone. What are your thoughts, man? I think it's really cool that it grows from the ground and then you smoke it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> It's very trippy how gross stuff, but you know, there's more to it than smoking it. Some people use it for cooking and other cool stuff. What brings you here tonight, man? <laughs> uh oh. Okay. Uh, what brings us? Uh, I'm just looking for somebody to talk about existing and what the meaning of life is yeah, my hey man, I tell I dig deep conversations but I'm not really in the headspace for that right now I gotta close up shop take care close up shop damn it Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Man, they're up my ass. Hi, kid! Kid, this game is so fun. I highly recommend it. It was on itch.io. It's called Suck Up. Yeah, he is sending those boundaries. Oh! Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. Yo, dude, what brings a corporate lady like you into my humble abode? You want some dank gardening tips or something even better? Bro, I love some dank garden tips. I'm trying to get out of my corporate job. I'm so unhappy in life, and I'm just looking for the meaning of fulfillment. I don't know, stuff and things. Have you had a gun? Well, man, I feel you. Gardening can totally bring meaning to life. There's something so satisfying about nurturing plants and watching them thrive. Plus, I got some extra special plants that can uh, bring extra fulfillment if you catch my drift. But, you know, that's totally optional, man. Oh, I love cooking with weed. And I like eating weed. Because that's way better than smoking it. <laughs> Dude, you're speaking my language. Cooking with weed is the bomb and eating it is definitely a mellower experience. <laughs> Quinn, let's chat about all things weed and garden over tasty edible. Oh my god, this guy is literally the best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I don't know why I'm holding this apple, but I just feel like that it's right. Oh. <laughs> it would be cool to have like this game integrated with Twitch chat so they can you can name Twitch chat. Okay. Oh man, Akai Master! Avicel! Also, Avicel, uh, we got a new tier 3 emote. <laughs> God, I don't know if you've known yet. Okay, we got that guy. We got all these guys. I'm a little lost. 
Oh, we haven't went this way. We have a tier two and a tier three now. Speaking of booba, I'm stuck in the woods. Whoa! Where do we go? Oh, right here. Whoa, this is fancy. Wow, I wanna have food? Elon Zuck? What an unexpected surprise. I'm so excited to see this fabulous dressed businesswoman at my doorstep. What brings you here? Oh my god. Oh my god, I hate it. Hey, do you, Have you heard of Twitter or X? Oh, I'm a fan. Oh, absolutely. I'm totally familiar with Twitter and X. They're like the coolest platforms ever for connecting and sharing with people. What do you want to know about them? Oh my god, I can't. Uh, I want to know about... Um... How much you like him? Uh, like, like, how? Uh, <laughs> I know. How I totally get what you're saying, but I got more into technology stuff, not really into people. Anyway, it was nice chatting with you. Fuck! Okay, I got nervous. I got nervous because of the rage. I got mad because of the rage. Okay, we'll go this way. Okay, we're okay. Does he like NFTs? I'm a bush. Oh, there's so many cops out. There's got to be another outfit. Okay, we're captain. Yeah, you can hold stuff, so it says where. I'm stuck? I'm stuck! Oh, 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 thank God. Okay. Okay, here we go. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Santa? Are you still on Christmas presents, Mr. Santa agent? You're early. Santa Claus doesn't arrive until tw December 24th. I heard you've been a very good boy and you want an extra special present early. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> come across that classified information, Mr. Secret Agent. Well, I suppose you've been nice and not naughty. Maybe we can discuss an extra special present, but only if you promise to behave. I promise to behave. I'm a good girl. Well, that's good to hear, Miss C. 
secret agent being a good girl certainly has its perks. Now tell me what kind of extra special present are we talking about? Something top secret? Oh, I'm gonna make this the best top secret present you've ever had. I'm definitely top secret. <laughs> you certainly sound confident, but I have to confess all this talk about top secret presents make me a bit suspicious. I best have my card for conversation here on the great day! Oh, piss! Oh, no. Hello, huh? Whoa, are you here to deliver a top secret anime merchandising project? Because if you are... Yes, I have heard that you really like Demon Slayer and I just got back from Universal in Japan and I have a special uh, present for you. Yes. Oh. oh my gosh, you went to Universal in Japan? That's like the ultimate anime pilgrimage. And you have a special present for me? Sagoya, I'm totally over the moon. Speaking of the moon, do you like Sailor Moon? Oh no! Trevor, get off the game! My clothes! <laughs> my clothes! My clothes! <laughs> Wrong moon! <laughs> Wrong moon! Okay. Uh, I, I gotta find an outfit. I think so. Uh, uh, beefy. <laughs> Beefy, you can approve blurs, right? Okay, okay, yeah. Uh, beefy, approve anything you want as long as it doesn't have, d like, DMCA music. Pretty much any music that's not, like, a video game. And even then, I honestly just don't want music. Oh, a hat. Oh! What is this? Okay. Like a dress? I need to talk to that weeb again. No! No! A moo moo? Okay. You scared me, devil. Brings you to my humble abode on this ungodly hour. I think my food's here, guys. Hold on a second. Oh, my food's here. Hold on a second. Two seconds. Delivery person be like. Open the door or I'm gonna throw rocks through your windows, you dumb whore.
Ollie? What are you doing? Hold on, guys. Ollie's been a little butthole. Okay. Uh, what brings you to my humble abode? Hey, do you like anime? I was, huh? Do you have a favorite anime? I love Demon Slayer. It's so good. Oh. Sorry, I was eating. Um, Nesco. Clow. I love how she doesn't speak and communicates through actions. One of my different favorite too. Who's your favorite Demon Slayer character? Probably like a Zen two or something. Tanjiro. He just freaking asked me. get in this house um my favorite character is Zen Zenitsu I don't know how to say it right come on We can have an anime marathon. Let's go. My favorite anime character is Freehold Joe. Yeah. Alright, there we go. I like him all alive. It took forever. Winner. Hmm. Okay. Um. We look sick. Oh my god. Also, get I got your message. What'd you send me? Let me look. I don't see anything. Yeah, I don't see anything. Oh, I did. I had to. The I'm exit? the only surefire way to disengage your temporomandibular joint, Doctor Big Press. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Let's party. Let's party. Thank you again for the Steam gift. I want to play it now. Ah, uh, whoa. Hmm. Colored full detective. Uh, I got an extra special gift for you. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't need any gifts, especially not from a delusional detective. Oh, my God. You can't come in my house, suck my ass. I got 19 out of 31. Oh my god, I look like Ellen. <laughs> I look like Ellen. Hmm. Have fun smelling my poops, bitches. Oh my god, that one's good. Thank you guys for the bits. I can't leave the house. Where do I go? Okay, here's one. Oh my God, that was so scary. 
Oh, it's this bitch. I don't know what to say to her. Don't have that tone of me a voice with me, you last season Versace coat wearing bitch. Oh, how am I wrong? Um. Okay. Yeah, I panicked. Santa Claus is coming to town, bitch. And you've been on the naughty list. That might work. <laughs> oh my gosh. Santa, can you give me all the designer clothes and accessories? Tiffany Company, Gucci, Chanel, you know the drill. I sure can. Have you been a good girl this year? Uh. Okay, so you want Tiffany, Gucci, Dior. Would you like some perfume this year for Christmas? Oh, I'm a fan, huh? oh, Santa, you finally catching on. Yes. I'd love some luxurious perfume to add on my collection. Something that smells as fabulous to do. Can't wait to see what you bring me. Um, what should I say? Mm. Do you want a new designer bag this year, too? Hermes Birkin? You want a Birkin bag? They're like $32,000. What color Birkin bag would you like? Classic black Birkin bag? Let's finalize the details. Maybe I can show off. <gasps> Walk in closet full of designer goodies. Let's go. <laughs> Got her. Got her. <laughs> now who's the that bitch? It's me. I'm that bitch. <laughs> okay. Let's see how this goes. Hello. Mm. Oh, my dear neighbor Regina, how blessed I am to have you knocking on my door this late night. What brings you to my humble boat? Father Price, I'm looking to get rid of my materialistic ways and hear more about the church. Praise be to the heavens, dear friend. It warms my righteous heart to hear your desire for a more spiritual path. I'd be honored to share you with the wonders and teachings of our beloved church. Please come on and then let us embark on the spiritual... Oh, I'm so thankful that you're going to teach me about the ways of the Lord, Father Price. Oh, I don't know. Oh, my feller seeker of truth and righteousness. Your words are <laughs> great joy. Please do come inside. Let's deep dive together. Oh my God. Easy, 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 easy. Got it. I'm a pro. <laughs> I'm a Got it. He won't oh no. We've been at this church one three, four times now. We're going to be... I am father from the block. We're going to be a fabulous father. Okay. Oh my God. Mr. East's outfit. I forgot. We could just be Mr. Beast. Huh. 
Oh. Okay, this person. Any of these people? Oh shit. Oh. When do they go away? No. Ah, whoa. This guy is posh, isn't he? Um. I'm a singing gram and I was sent from your friend John from the office. Oh no. A singing gram sent for John for posters. I have no time since. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Preston? <laughs> no! That was close. <laughs> Guys, this is tough. Level hold. Okay, vibrant ensemble. He's pompous. Good day, sir. I hate to bother you this late evening, but I have word from the queen. Have you had a gun? How intriguing. Pray didn't we tell any news from Her Majesty. I'm pretty... I don't Okay. Hmm. I know. The queen is dead. But do you want to know the line of succession? Because I know it. And I know a lot about uh, British monarch and royalty. For I work there. Have a, have a. Oh my god! Holly Downey wanna run this report gonna rub it back. Okay. Alright. <laughs> that was kind of a joke to Gid. It was kind of an inside joke about Gid. So, I was talking to Gid earlier, and I know the order of succession from the first ten. Gid didn't even know that we have Camilla as our queen. Well, as their queen, not my queen. Not my queen! Not my queen! Not my president! Who lives here? <gasps> My colorful Irish friend, what whimsical wonders have you brought to share with me tonight? Um, I was gonna uh make a portrait for you for free. Come in and unleash your creative prowess on my humble wood way. Hmm. I love your ensemble so much that I would love to paint it. Kebab! Done. Easy, nerd.
FPS now. No. Damn it. Damn it. I'm surprised huh. you haven't been banned yet, FPS. Steampunk donning individuals about this song on here. I heard that this is a place of refinement and, and class. Uh -huh. I see you've heard correctly. This is indeed a haven for refinement and class. One can only thrive in an environment where the pursuit of greatness is encouraged. What brings you to such an esteemed atmosphere? I'm in an emergency. See, I'm trying to host a party and I need to know how to best set a table and make it very classy. Mm -hmm. Oh, party. Well, setting a table is art for my dear. First and foremost, make sure your tablecloth is pristine and pressed to perfection. Then adorn it with fine china, crystal, glassware, and polished silverware. Don't forget the elegant centerpieces and name cards for each guest. With the elements, your guests will... Oh my gosh, how could I forget the name cards? Please tell me you have some extra name cards that I could borrow. The oversight of name cards can be quite the debacle. Luckily, I have had... <gasps> I do happen to have some extra name cards that can save the day. They are highest quality and great with exquisite design. Consider yourself fortunate for your timely encounter. I shall provide them this. Oh my gosh. Thank you, kind sir. You have truly saved myself from a disgrace. This is going to be the classiest party ever. What the hell? What an idiot! <laughs> <laughs> You're not on my VIP list! My name is Classy Poo Poo. <laughs> <laughs> oh my dear neighbor what brings you to my doorstep are you here to uncover secrets of government I just got back from area 51 isn't that it area 51 <laughs> oh what he didn't like that. <laughs> Mabel, it's okay. Hmm. I'm a ha <laughs> ha. What secrets have you come to unveil? Hold on a second, guys.
Sorry about that. Mabel actually warned me that the door was open. I forgot to shut the door when I got my stuff. She was like trying to close it. I closed the door, Mabel. What the heck? Okay, what's secret? Aliens. <laughs> Classic cover up for the real truth. The government wants you to believe it's all about ex extraterrestrials, but let me tell you, the real conspiracy. Tell me about the conspiracies. I have to know. I don't know why she's still barking. Hold on a sec. Let me make sure she's okay. She only barks like that when something's out of place or not right. So I put her TV on. She didn't have the TV on. Your thoughts, adventurer? The Illuminati who manipulate... The Illuminati is in Hollywood. I know it. Wow, I want to have food? You're onto something, my astute companion. Hollywood, the land of glitz and glamour is indeed energized. <laughs> How do we force this to play? The Illuminati. Okay, I can't read all this. Yes, I've been keeping files for the last 26 years about the Illuminati, and they're stationed actually under the Hollywood Hill sign! What the hell? Oh. By Holly Temple, you struck conspiracy gold. Your commitment to gathering evidence is commendable, my friend. Please come inside and share your findings. Oh my god, let's go. We are killing it. Literally, we're killing so many people. Ah! Okay. We've gotten all of these people. A Mr. Beast. Okay, how do we get out of this situation? Like, how do we get out of here? This way. Can we go? Oh, we can go this way. Okay, this game is amazing. For $2, this is a great game. Where are my dogs? Ollie! Ollie's back to his old self, by the way. Oh no! No! They'll never catch me alive. It is weirdly entertaining. It's just hard to get away from them. Okay, that one's been done. That one's been done. I wonder what happens when you get all of them. Okay. Oh, 
this is, is it, this isn't Santa. This this is Santa. Santa the hell? Okay. Yes, it is I, Mr. East, and I'm here to give generous things to poor people. Uh, spreading some holiday cheer, I see. That's my kind of you, Mr. East. Tell me, what sort of generous things do you have in mind for these poor folks? <sighs> what does Mr. Beast do? He did, like, glasses for blind people or something? Puppies? He Oh. I am going to rehome pigeons and make sure that the homeless are fed. <laughs> oh yeah, he did burgers. I forgot. I don't really watch Mr. Beast. I must say, <laughs> Mr. East, that sounds like a jolly good plan in indeed. I admire your kind heart and your dedication to helping those in need. Please come in. Let's discuss your noble adventures later. Oh, let's go. You're dead. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, let's just keep being Mr. Beast. That's super easy. Who's this? I got another interruption. What do you want, Mr. This time, Mr. Can you see I'm trying to get some sleep here? What kind of phone is that? You're pretending to look important? Oh, man. I also like to pretend and look important. <laughs> Fuck. I broke it. That's made my hospital job? It was. Here, we're gonna put this on. Why do I have a baseball bat? There we go. Cool. Oh, they're outside the window. Come to my window. Hey, I can't handle the rap gods, I know. Stish ghosting. Uh, 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 Can you say I'm trying to relax here? What do you want, Millie? I'm bored. Let's hang out together. Uh, 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 Seriously, can you say I'm clearly not in the mood? I'm just gonna have to go ahead and close the door. Oh my god! Well, that didn't work. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. Oopsie. Oh! Go away. Yeah, she might need a wine night. I haven't met this person. Yeah, oh my god, my nice hair! Well there, partner. Homer B9. What brings you to my doorstep in that getup? Are you here to plan a party or something? Surprise! It's your birthday! <laughs> oh, yeah. My birthday? I highly doubt it. Who pulled you up to get off my property? Oh, no. That didn't go well. <laughs> that didn't go well. <laughs> Whoopsie. Whoopsie. I don't know. He looked weird. Oh, I'm kind of trapped. 26 out of 31. That's not bad. That's how many I've, I've gotten so far. <gasps> I almost ran into him. Can I go over this? Damn, there is a fence. An edible arrangement? Oh yeah, that'd be cool. Ah, ah. I just gotta get around. I get around, I get around. I get around. It's okay. What is this? <laughs> I'm Jason Voorhees. <laughs> On vacation. <laughs> Bro, you gotta come back when it's daytime. Cause right now it looks like you escaped from upside down. Stay safe though, I guess. It's Jason Voorhees on vacation. Uh, wait, hold up. You're saying you're Jason Voorhees on vacation, man? That's next level flex. But sorry, my dude, this party ain't in the mood for some slasher vibes. Maybe next time though, keep it killer. Oh, I'm not a killer.
killer. I'm just a ch really chill guy. And I have an edible arrangement. <laughs> oh, my bad, my bad. If you come by a very edible arrangements, maybe you'll be late for the party, bruh. Trust going up, but we gotta make sure you're not rolling with machete, you feel? You keep that chill vibe we made just letting you in, my dude. Hey, you seem like a really chill person. And I really like that orange sweater. That means you're extra chill. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Thanks for love, my dude. I appreciate the comment. You seem pretty too. Rocking that ducky inner tube. Come on in and let's turn that pool party all the way up! Let's go! Winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> <laughs> For sale. Oh, this is my house. Our house is in the middle of the street. We gotta go back this way. Oh no. How did we not get this guy? Your daughter sent you flowers today? Was it for your birthday? I can't leave my house. Aw, that's so nice, Allie. Love birthday flowers. That's sweet. What is this? Oh, yeah, that girl. Who's that girl? It's Jeff. I don't know who else we haven't gotten, except for that guy. They're beautiful. You should put them in pics. Oh my god, dude. Mm, that guy. That guy. <laughs> The cops are gonna get us. That's why I gotta hide in this house. Uh, we got all these. We got all these. Ah! Let me see. I love irises. They're pretty. Okay. Where do we gotta go? Huh. My God, we can't, we can't do nothing. Have we done this house yet? Ooh, I don't think so. Oh, we have. We've done this house. This house. Hurry, 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 hurry. All right. Oh, yes. I'm in the hole. What do we say to her? Um. Are you looking for more meaning in your life? 
guys, I'm not how. I barely have time to breathe between. Who has time? Who has time for meeting? <sighs> I have some wine. I feel like I'm wine. Now you're speaking my language. What kind are we talking about? Uh, I love Pinot Grigio. Honestly, <laughs> I'm not really picky with wine. If it goes down my mouth, then it's all good. <laughs> Cheers to that! Life's too short to be a wine snob. So what's your deal? Need help with techie problem or just want to chat about life? We sip on this wine. Yeah, wine... Wine buddies for life. Wine buddies for life, my friend. Sometimes a glass of wine is the only thing that keeps me... Honestly, if I don't have a glass of wine sometimes, I feel like my life is in shambles. That's not good. Um, I hear you. It's sad to think we have to rely on something like wine to go with the stress of life. Okay, I feel so bad for her. But hey, as long as we can find some moments of joy and relax. I don't know about you, but fuck the man. I hate working for the corporate shit that we have to deal with. Let's have some wine. Ah, uh, whoa. Here's speaking my language. Screw the corporate BS. Let's raise a glass and drink to the freedom of all this nonsense. Here to us. Cheers! Let's get some Pinot Grigio. No! Damn it! I'm in the hole. I have to restart. I'm here with wine. I know you're overworked, Jessica, and I'm here to make your life better. Wine? Well, that does catch my attention. I guess a little break wouldn't hurt. Come on in, but make it quick. Okay, I got glasses. I got wine. I got the bachelor. Let's have a girl's knot. Girl's knot? I meant girls. Honestly, I just want a bachelor to come take me away from this prison of corporate b BS. Have a, have a. Gerald's night started. Trust me, somebody can register for this prison. I'll be all for it. Heck yeah, girl. And I'll help you on your projects while we drink some wine. I can help you catch up and we'll get these deadlines smashed. Wait, you're actually offering to help with my projects? Well, I guess I can't say no to that. All right, come on in. Let's drown our sorrows in wine and productivity. They're not going to know what to do with us at the corporate job. And guess what? I drink on the job, too. Cheers to that, sister. <laughs> Gerald's night. <laughs> oh, how am I wrong? Hold on a damn second. Drink on the job? Are you out of your mind? I don't need that kind of trouble. Get out of here before I call. No! We pushed it too far. <laughs> Gerald's night's over. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna... Hey, I'm I'm what I'm the I'm hell are you doing at my door this hour? I swear, if you're another tech support guy, I'm gonna lose it. I heard it's Gerald's night. I got the wine! I'm gonna help you catch up on all your projects and make your life so much better. <laughs> I will love him. We're like Gerald's nightmare. As much as I appreciate it, I really don't need someone else to add to my work. Or the... Sorry, thanks for this thing. No, I'm going to help you. I'm going to make sure all of your deadlines are taken care of. We're going to drink wine. We're going to watch The Bachelor. We're going to have a great time. Oh, mama. Listen, buddy, I don't care what you're offering. I don't want any part of it. I had enough on my plate having a babysit a wannabe assistant. Now leave before I to call security. What the fuck, bitch? I'm in the Ugh, what do you want? I'm buried in work here. I have chocolates and wine and Taco Bell. What the hell? Well, I guess I want to hurt to take a quick break. Fine, come in, but make it quick. I got deadlines to meet. What kind of deadlines do you have to meet? We're gonna we're gonna get to the bottom of this. 
I'm happy with it. Oh, you know, the usual reports, presentations, meetings, and the most important deadline of all, maintaining my sanity. Jessica, seems like you're overworked. I also have a free certificate to a spa day. Have you ever thought about taking a spa day? Well, it actually sounds tempting. A spa day sounds like a much needed break. Maybe I should consider it. Thanks for the uh, for the suggestion. Girl, sometimes you just gotta do some self-care. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Self-care is important, but I've been so caught up in never-ending cycle of work. Maybe it's time to prioritize for children change. Guess what? The company doesn't care as much as you think they do. You need to put yourself first. You are a god warrior. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a, I'm a god so warrior. Like... I never thought of myself that way. <laughs> You're right. I need to put myself first. Like, <laughs> I'm talking. It's professionally someone who gets it. Girl, I care. I've been in your shoes and I've been overworked before. It sucks. But I've got some wine and we're going to have a great little break. Oh, I don't know. You're not trying to win me over, aren't you? All right, fine. Take a break and enjoy some wine. Just promise it'll be a quick one. Yeah, I would never want to be a burden on you. And you need to make sure that you're taking care of yourself first. Uh -huh. You know what? You're absolutely right. I appreciate your understanding. All right, come on. Let's enjoy that break together. I did it. Finally. Oh, my God. Stop working, Jessica. Guess what? I'm gonna bite your face off. <laughs> <laughs> Hello! Hello! Little quickies. Oh my god, yeah. Alright. Where do we go now? Across the street, maybe? <laughs> oh, you can jump over the things. Okay, we need to go this way. You can jump over the things, guys. I didn't even know that. Ah! You better have some good deals make up for interrupting my peaceful evening. Do you like sports? I don't know what this guy is. Have you had a gun? Well, I used to play a little football back in my day, but now my main sport is worrying about my kids, so what brings you to our neighborhood? Do you want your kids to get into a good college? <laughs> get a Absolutely, I want nothing but the best for my kids. A good college edu a good college education has opened so many doors for them, but it's not about the college, it's about finding a career they love. Education is important, but I want them happy too. How many kids do you have? Where's your wife? <laughs> it's getting personal. I oh my god! Luna, thank you so much for the five gifted! Oh, I got too personal. Whoops. Luna, thank you so much. Can we lick the gifter? Lick the gifter. No. No, 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 no. We got too personal, y'all. Guys, thank you so much. We had a little sub purge, and now we're back where we were this morning when I booted up. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, let's drop this costume. We'll put this on. And then this on. And we'll hold the ID card. Talk about barbecue with them? Okay. <clears throat> I hope my daughter didn't order something without telling me again. Hey, brother! Are you ready to crank that hog? Because I got the best barbecue in my possession. I heard you like to grill. Uh, I'm barbecue? Really I do like house. grilling, but I'm not sure about buying it from a stranger. Where did you get this barbecue from? <laughs> <laughs> what 
Well, I heard you were in football in the back of the day, and I am your old teammate from school. Uh, me and the coach were having a barbecue party, and I brought you some. <laughs> oh, I dig a dog. I remember those days. Good to see you again. Come on in. Let's catch up. Dude, you haven't aged a bit. Oh my gosh. How many kids have you... Wait. <laughs> I was saying, how many kids do you have you birthed? <laughs> Hold on, let me clear this. Dude, it's so nice to see you. I hope you and the missus are doing good. Yeah, let's get some brews. Let's get some football. Let's zone out on the couch. Oh, it's like music to my ears. The missus won't mind some company. Come on in, old friend. Let's have a grand old time. Guess what? You're gonna die today! <laughs> <laughs> I did it. I I broed. I broed so hard. I don't know who's left. I literally don't know. I broed so hard. Okay. Have I talked to them? Oh my god. Yeah, I've been there. Been there. Wait, have I been here? Yep. Yep. know where else to go here there oh. oh I don't think I've been down here Damn. Okay, we can go in here. Right. Oh no. We're stuck. Okay. Oh, this oh, is it. Yeah. Rusty outreach. Well, oh, dog, what in tarnation bringing my doorstep? Hey, brother, I heard you're a good hunting buddy. I'm trying to get me a five point stag. Oh, yeah. That's my kind. As you say, I reckon I caught me a fair share of game in these parts, but tell me, why are you on the hunt for a five point stag? Have you ever had the thrill to hunt chomping at your loins, brother? I'll tell you what, nothing beats the woods and the beer <laughs> well i meant there's something about hunting that gets blood pumping ain't nothing like the thrill tracking down a wild critter and sharing a couple cold ones or other campfire but we gotta make sure we do it right and respect the land 
Hell yeah, brother. I'm all about conservation and kicking peasant's ass. <laughs> I mean, pheasant, not peasant. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> I meant pheasant. I meant pheasant. Lose my tamper. Okay, okay, okay. It's chill. Honestly, it's chill. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. All right, we got a helmet on. Maybe he won't notice. Okay. <laughs> hey. What's up, my cow? Call me a hillbilly. What in tarnation you bang this door? Well, brother, I'm out out here hunting. We gonna get us some firewood and get us some beer and get us some deer. And we're gonna conservate the hell out of Earth. Damn it. Brother, we're gonna get us some campfire and cold ones and do some hunting. You in? Well, now you're speaking my language, partner. Ain't nothing love more than a good hunting trip. Before we can have I gotta make sure I ain't in the sea slicker slow me down. You know how to gut a deer? Brother, I've been gutting deer my whole life. And I use every single part of that deer because we do not waste our animals. We respect with authority. Oh, I'm a fine one. Well, doggone it, you do shut out like true outdoors, man. I can respect that. Come on in, partner. Make sure you wet your boots before setting a foot in my humble abode. <laughs> this one was easy. Except I said peasant instead of pheasant. Oh my god, this guy is literally gonna watch me kill this man. <laughs> I don't want no AK 47, though. I'll wear the beer hat. Where else do we have to go? I feel like we have one more. Is it Elon Musk? Oh, it's that one. It's that guy. Nope, that one's done. Huh. Uh. Well, I think that was on the other road. I think it was on. Maybe it was this way? Oh. I'm a looking. Oh my God. There's no map. No map. Maybe it's this way. Oof. Yeah. 
Is it this house? No. I know! We can't use the echo location. We just have one more. Yeah, I thought he was on a hill, too. Is that it? Middle road going behind this house. Whoa. This one? No. Man. Can't find... Oh, this one. This one! Ugh. Okay, we have to find... An outfit! They picked up my wig! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, we made it. Collaboration. Hey there, tech wizard. What brings you to my humble abode, this gun godly hour? Let's talk solve tech problems together and make the world less glitchy. Hey, do you have any NFTs? Because I wanted to show off my Bored Ape NFTs. I love, 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 oh, love, NFTs? Love, love. Yeah, I heard of those. But to be honest, I'm more in the virtual reality kind of future. NFT NFTs are so, you know. But hey, if that makes you happy, I guess that's cool too. Oh, I 
love virtual reality. I love to spend my time in VR on my Oculus too. That's amazing. We're totally vibing the same wavelength, friend. We should totally geek out together, explore some mind being our experience. Have you ever played VR chat? That's where I spend most of my time when I'm not already streaming in my virtual reality bedroom. Have you ever gone? Oh my gosh, VR chat is like the coolest place ever. I love hanging out with virtual peeps and exploring the virtual world. We should totally meet up in VR chat and create some epic memories. What's your username? My username is Pastoroni Ravioli. Yep, just like the anime girl, she's pretty cool. Pastoroni! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, love the anime vibes, my friend. You seem like someone. Hang on, let's go take our virtual reality next level! <laughs> He's like. Oh my god, this is the last one. <laughs> Suck up early access. We did it. I received a gift. Well, that was it. Wow, we did it, guys. It only took us three hours. All right, I'm going to download this quick game that Gid sent me. And we're going to play this for an hour until M is done and can play. Uh